Hey folks, I'm here today to talk about how to unlock Calamity Ganon, which is the final hidden character in Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity. So if we go over here to the right, and I should recommend straight away, spoiler warning, so I'm going to be talking about the main story and things after the main story, so if you don't want to be spoiled, come back after the story ends. If you're continuing, well, I've given you a warning, so what can you do? So to unlock Calamity Ganon, you first need to complete the final mission, which is here, the future of Hyrule. And then also repaired and put back together um, the mini guardian. I forget what its name is now. Let me just try and find it in my thing. Here. Put back Terrico, which will require you to do a bunch of different little quests that look like this. That will require you to collect 50. Some of them will be missions, some of them are not bodyguards, etc. From there. You're then going to have to do a series of challenges and go through all of these. You need to get to recommended level 71 to 80, in which as you can see I haven't unlocked yet. But you have to complete every single challenge for every single thing on the game. Then once you finish that and you've unlocked the 71 to 80 quests, a quest will appear right here, which will allow you to go and face Calamity Ganon. Being in Calamity Ganon on top of this mountain will unlock the character for you, and then you'll be able to go about your day and do your quests and everything of these, knowing you have the full roster of characters. So that's it. That's the short and sweet detail. And uh, the reason that I'm showing you and uh, like telling you is because I've been trying, like I've been grinding for hours, and I've I've got to the point now where I can't play anymore, and I've got to move on to other games. So I'm just giving you guys the information that you need in order to get through. So again, complete the game. Fix Terrico. I don't think the Divine Beasts matter, um, but do make sure you go through the list. If you go here, you'll see, for instance, I have four quests here. So I know, for instance, that I need to complete these before the 71 to level 80 recommended level challenges will appear on my map. So there you go. That's it, guys. Hope that helps you out. And as always, I will see you in the next video.